Hi everyone and welcome to another episode of Two RC. Today we'll be talking on some of the upgrades I've done on my DBXL, specifically three upgrades. Um, two of them are definitely an improvement, the third one I'm not quite sure. Uh, but we'll be going through that just now so one of them that you guys can see is this exhaust pipe uh, that we'll be going through it in, in a minute in a minute so the other ones is that i've done to this to be excel is i've used robbers the you know the rubber boots that go on the axles rear axles i've got two of those and I got one on the front and on the back and one on the front just to keep dirt from getting in there and to keep the grease just there you know and that works perfect that's a very cheap and nice upgrade I would say the other upgrade I've done I need to kind of turn the truck for this there it goes. It's on the fuel tank. So, you know, uh, with the mounts, the fuel tank actually comes off. So, what I've done is basically went and got some 30 mil long M4s, counter screws, and basically I just screw through the old mounts and and I just uh, put it through and put an M4 on top and it just holds it perfectly in place and it does not move because the, the those mounts they only have a little bit of uh, thread to it and the mounts the, the screws just tend to come out so that's a nice up, uh, change upgrade whatever you want to call, call it um, the other one now, the big one, it's the exhaust pipe. So the exhaust pipe is basically <laughs> a King Motor Baja exhaust pipe. Uh, the one that you get uh, original with the Baja, that's what that is. So my neighbor, he's got King Motor Baja and he recently got uh, an upgraded exhaust, a, a DDM lookalike exhaust. I, I can really remember if it's a, I, it could possibly be a DDM. But he upgraded his one. He knew that I wanted one, an upgraded for upgraded exhaust pipe for my DBXL. But I'm reluctant to pay over 160 pounds for the exhaust pipe. So. <laughs> He came to my house and he knocked at the door and he asked me if I've got a saw that could cut through metal. And I said, yeah, I do have one. So I gave him and this is what he came up with. So basically he cut uh, the manifold in a way that you could just use a silicone um, rubber seal, whatever. Um, connect both in the way the exhaust comes down and just use cable ties although saying that uh, on both sides on this bit of the manifold and on that bit you do have to make a lip on the on the pipe so it doesn't slide off uh, because that will do uh, eventually happen uh, it happened to me the first test and then I did that and has not come off and basically it comes down and is getting uh, hold by its uh, original mounting bracket thing brace whatever you want to call it uh, down to the chassis over here uh, I've used a, a 20 millimeter uh, servo mount I got that from blacksmith products uh, they got tons of those unfortunately 
I had some M4s, but I couldn't find them, so I ended up for using an M3. So instead of uh, M4 coming from the bottom, which it originally is, there's an M M3. But it's holding everything in place as it should be. And then basically what I've done is um, focus. There it goes. Um, I drill a hole so I could put the the bracket, the mounting bracket thing through and then I just put an M3 through the top just to hold it in place and try to lock it and that holds it in place now I'm just uh, gonna grab the body or roll cage whatever you want to call it sitting just over there and put it on so you guys can see the clearance now with the body on as you can see there's plenty of clearance and there's another thing uh, with this exhaust pipe there is you can put it uh, basically facing any way you can uh, turn turn all this around because this is still has that standard uh, bracket bit um, there's many ways of putting it in you can actually put it in a way that you can come out out of here through here and it would actually look cool but the problem is if you got one of those air filters uh, that will be impossible because you kind of have to slide the, the body uh, forwards to that so that could fit and unfortunately it does not fit like that but that that is it guys uh Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please comment, like and subscribe for more upcoming videos. See you later. Thank you. <laughs> Silly girl. Are you okay? <laughs>